This midday, parents, they are sharing more information about how their kids ended up in the hospital after an off-season football practice. Now, the head coach at Rockwell Heath High School remains on leave this morning. Our Tiffany Liu reports. One mother tells us her son couldn't lift his arms, brush his teeth, or even get dressed by himself. That's when she contacted the school, who then sent out a letter to parents. It was during an off-season workout for the football team at Rockwell Heath High School. The students told their moms they did 368 push-ups during one workout period. Moms of two players say their 15-year-old boys spent 11 days in the hospital with rhabdomyolysis. And rhabdo happens when your muscles are severely damaged. It releases dangerous proteins into the blood, and in serious cases, it can be fatal or cause a permanent disability. The football coach, John Harrell, is now on administrative leave pending a third-party investigation by a law firm. We also learned that Child Protective Services is now investigating, too. The football players say they made a total of 23 mistakes that day during conditioning, and their punishment was 16 push-ups per mistake because in Texas it takes 16 games to win a state title. Um, so uh, her son was came home from school on Friday with a very lot of soreness, where he was walking very stiffly. He could barely couldn't even move his arms. You know, I was appalled. I was absolutely disappointed that this occurred to my child. And Rockwell ISD has not released the number of students who were injured during that practice, but parents say they were told at least 15 students needed to seek medical treatment or were hospitalized. We are still trying to get that number confirmed. We also know that tonight there is a regular school board meeting scheduled. Of course, we're going to keep a close eye on that. In Heath, I'm Tiffany Liu.